Hello everyone, welcome back to the shed. I'm Lonnie. Hey, I'm Candace. Welcome back. We're about to head out the door. Yeah, we got a call from, uh, or a text from Guy yesterday morning. And um, it's now Monday, our time. And uh, yeah, it's it's time for us to go meet Guy and take a look at what we're buying today. We we already know, but we'll we'll hold off and let y'all wait a few more seconds before you find out. Yep. Let's go. Let's go. All right, we are over at Guy's place now with Hi. Candace. And uh Guy Hi. is around Guy's around the corner. Hey guy. Hey. And uh today welcome back, welcome back to Guy's but what's the name of this joint guys anyway? Guy's place. Um <laughs> Huh? I don't know. You need to name it. I know. You got this we nice commercial We're gonna come, up with, gonna come up with a name for want, you. But you know, um You don't want what traffic up in here, you know, right? Not yet, anyway, huh? No, no, no. no. <laughs> then what would I sell y'all? Uh, yeah, that's a good question. Yep. Uh, maybe you'd sell us your posters. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, anyways, so today we are, we're going to take a look at all these Hot Wheels. The guy bought, we'll go through them pretty slowly here. Um, there are some really nice pieces. I'm not going to, I'm not going to just speed through them because I know some of y'all no hot wheels and there's a few other things too we'll know what the yeah there's a few other pieces too this is this buy is going to be a little bit different because uh guy does have i'm assuming i don't ever ask him how much he exactly he has into stuff i'm assuming he has a pretty good bit into it and he's got to make his money and then i've got to figure out if this is worth it for us to make money with so guy is asking us to actually comp all this stuff to some extent so we can figure out the value yep. and uh so that's what we're gonna do so what what are the best pieces here guy that i could show show the viewers this one this the, okay this is the shelby Co cobra 427 that comp this is the one that was comping at like five hundred and something dollars guy five to eight forty seven five to eight hundred and forty seven yeah. somewhere in that range okay eighteen hundred ninety two of four thousand is the serial number on this one and then what's the next is this the next most expensive piece That's here but there's other ones like the corvette this thing right right here okay and approximately what is this because i haven't like these aren't red line club are they uh, yeah they are they're yeah like show exclusive show that exclusive one's, that one's cheaper 240 to 300. 240 to 300 on that one okay and then bone shaker yeah that one's cheaper that's um like 150 oh so when you say cheaper cheap. it's still it's cheap. not cheap it's cheaper <laughs> yeah look i really like these um monopoly. johnny lightning monopoly cars with the small versions that are like movers yeah those are cool those are really cool i could see somebody just wanting oh, yeah, that whole set that, look. oh look at that look a whole set yeah both both this has the other colors. And look, they, that one has the original price tag on it there. Yeah. Aston Martin. So this is the Aston Martin DB10. The Elite Series. Okay. And that one's, um, the comps are... Wasn't it like 300 and something? or? Uh, I can't remember what it was. 310 to 513. 310 to 513 comp range. And then um, this is the Hershey's set... From 2011 2011, yeah. 2011 this is the best piece out of that uh we saw prices all over the place um i figure about 150 dollars though for this van depending i mean it just depends on what you're getting and you see there's another hershey set here and we have the same hershey set over here minus one minus one car yeah that's right it only has nine of them Here's a, another set that's pretty good. It's the Japan Historics, the, uh, the first release, first series. Okay. And it's because of this car right there. This is the best car in there. Oh, I see. It's one of five, two of five. This is also kind of good guy because 
the more of these that I can sell, like five at a time or six at a time, it's less transactions I have to make. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't I don't have to box up like two hundred different different shipments that way. You know, what are where are these from? That's a bull run, a special event, and um, I saw no soul comps. There's I think one listed, but they're all loose. Huh. They're, and that one, I think they're asking like 50, but these are sealed. In these the, are all in their little baggies. What is it called? I'll look it up on Bull here. Run. Bull Run. That's a Corvette set. Is that Hot Wheels? Yeah. But it was like a special event. Check this guy out. Krispy yeah, Kreme it's truck. Much. It's, it's just cool. But, I, um, some of the cooler ones aren't, aren't really worth that these much. These are convention really. cars over there. Some of them are better than others. You know, the better. Mm -hmm. These are all convention cars? Yes. I guess this, huh? Collectors Nationals. And here's something else, too. A convention car, but the, the dinner cars. You had to go to the dinner. The dinner? Mm -hmm. Have you ever been to the dinner? No. <laughs> no? And How do you get to the dinner? National, uh, uh, training cars, you know, baseball car conventions I have. But that's... Okay. Collectors Nationals. Produced. Paint. Tampo design. Okay, those are cool. Oh, those are the little uh, hangers. Mm -hmm. I see now. Okay. All right. This is some pretty unique stuff, huh? It's not dime a dozen stuff. Remember when I explained to you on the phone, this was remnants of that big red line club. Right. Yeah. If y'all, uh, the those of you that have been watching the channel for a while uh, might remember what... About was, four, this is about four years ago. Is it, four years? Th two. Three? No, no is it? I was, I was still at the It probably was at least was four four, years. It was four years. Four years, yeah. Because, um... I get the phone call and, um... Yeah, I, I, dude, I was... I, I so trusted you on that buy because Guy had one big acrylic thing. How many cars was it? Close to 100, maybe. Was 80, it that many? 80, 80 90 cars. And... I, I spent $3,000 with Guy on that and uh, ended up making That's all it was. big money. You were a nervous wreck, huh? I was a nervous wreck. <laughs> that because was one of the biggest uh, transactions we one, uh, I mean, time. We've had, we've had a few bigger, but that was at that time, that might have been the especially record. Especially per item. I think that may have been the record at that time. And I, I wasn't worried about it. Like, I, we had, we had done enough tra transactions, and I looked a few up. But I didn't believe it until, because I just didn't know cars that well. You, you understand? Sold, you sold that one truck for seven eight $800? One piece was like seven $800 Loose out of there. off the card. Loose, no card. It was the, uh, and whenever, I remember whenever I was showing, the side. it was a truck of some sort. But I remember when I was showing the, showing that collection to the viewers. Whenever I bought it, several people told me the uh, Andy Freeze Green whatever vehicle was like that was the best piece. Chevy it? Silverado. Was it a Silverado? That, I think that sounds right. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try and come up with the best we can because um, it's it's hard to comp every single thing. And see about what the value of this whole collection is. And see oh, if... It, oh, yeah, and the statues, too. Yeah. All right, so Candace is, is starting at that end. And I'm starting at this end. So far, I've comped these cars right here. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen cars. Hey, Guy, what do you think I've got? I'm gonna see, Let's see if Guy can guess... These cars right here, what do you think I've valued them at after looking on uh, eBay? Hundred. Oh, come on, seriously. What do you think? I don't know. You know it's hard to say. Huh? Yeah, yeah. That's okay. why I, I let you do the later. Okay. Job. I'm a, I'm at six sixteen retail value. Yeah. So on I, those. Don't, I don't know. I don't and know. I had to guess on a few. Mm -hmm. I had to guess on a few. So I'm. That's what we're doing. We're gonna keep. Yeah. The I couldn't find either one of these. Actually, I found I think an active on this one. I couldn't find this one sold. That's a so. drag bus. You couldn't find a drag bus. No, I couldn't find it. Not in that little. Look for it. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to look for it, yeah. sure you can. But yeah, the 
Best piece I found was 135. 75 I wrote down for another one. I think that was I think that was these two actually. Yeah, these two right here. Did you look that one up? That one not much. I don't know. I can't I can't remember which one it is because I didn't write it. The 442. I didn't I didn't write down which car was which, so I'm not sure. Yeah, the 442 is always a good casting. Okay. All right, I'm gonna move on to my next section. Okay, so we spent about what, Candace? Maybe an hour? I don't yeah. even know. I'll lose track of time when I come into the guy, guy's not place. Even that long. Maybe 45 minutes to an hour. Been over an hour. Has it? I, I have no idea. A guy's place is like a time a time thing or something. I don't know. But anyway, what I've done what I've done is uh, this area right, this section right here, up to these two cars, I have a retail value of six sixteen. Uh, some of the higher ones this these are the really high ones here this section right here i've got a value of 1405 that includes this specter uh aston martin db10 i valued that at 400 and then we actually have we have that other car is that one right there isn't it shelby, shelby cobra that mm -hmm. was right here this one yeah this one I valued at 560, and then there's a couple other good ones too. So just this area right here is 1405, and then this section up to here, cheap, we have at 353. And then Candace, you, you got to take it from here. Candace did all the rest of the comp. Yeah, I didn't do it like him, I have everything individually priced, so I. That's fine. I don't know if you want me to just go over everything. Or no, not uh, not too much. I'll like, go over like the bigger stuff, like these Japan historics. I, I have them at two hundred for the whole set. Okay. Um, that would be what we would sell them at. Right. Okay. Um. Let's see. What did you have this this little set at? That's um forty dollars. Forty for those. Yeah. Okay. Um. Doo -doo -doo -doo. This Hershey set two thirty. This one eighty. Okay. Um, this candy set here, um, 60, this one 70. Okay. Yeah, that's the one that's I have crazy. for 230. 230. Yeah. What about the Star Wars? Star this Wars is... are okay. I've got like They're 65, 40, 30, you know. Selling them all. all... As a set. Okay, yeah, because yeah. we do have complete sets. That's going to, that makes, that kind of changes the way I look at it too, because I don't really want to sell too many individual cars if yeah. I don't have to. I now mean, I this, will. Here's another Hershey set that's not complete, so I just did them at ten dollars each. Okay. Yeah. Um this what, what is this? This is really cool and um I'm like I'll take it out again, but I'll I guess we'll show it when we get back or when I get it listed I'll show you show you. That's the um <clears throat> where is it at? Sorry y'all. Um that's the Star Wars um, San, San Diego Comic Con exclusive little display set. It's four or five cars on this little track thing and they light up and make sounds and stuff. Oh, wow. It's in a little, the box is actually like a display case. And what did you value? 65 that at? at that. Okay. I like um, the Scooby, I like the uh, Mystery Machine. Mystery Machine there. is $30. Okay, that's that's cool. Um, Some of the cooler stuff isn't worth that much. It's, it's weird. It's not, yeah. I, know, I just I know how that it goes. In this but. little area, like the highest thing is um, these for 75 For all of them? Yeah, I like sell them. Because mm -hmm. there is more in the set. We don't have a complete set. Um, these will probably get lotted together for like 15 20 bucks. This Ninja Go case is pretty good. Uh, it's fifty. Is it just a case? Yeah, it's a di it's a display case for the, oh, the Ninja Go movie for little mini figs. Okay. Uh, and then we have the big statues, of course. Um, Carnage two hundred and Venom three eighty. So, okay. Yeah. So uh, now we just need to go add add up what our totals our expected retail value is and. Yeah see what guy wants and see how much money we could potentially make all right so i added up all of our expected value here um and this is this would be retail retail price what we sell it for hopefully um prior to ebay fees uh boxes um i'm gonna try and probably sell it without promoted listings but if we have to promote Maybe we promote it 2%, something like that. 
Um, and this is the total number that we came up with with total value for everything here. And uh, like I said, we're roughly, uh, let's see, let, let me think. Uh, about 13, 15. I, I mean, roughly our selling costs, if we get the buyers to pay shipping and all that, our selling costs are roughly going to be about 20% of that. Um, that that would be like the eBay fees. Um, what's that? Yeah, that's that's 80% of that number. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's that's assuming we, we get what we ask for everything. Yeah. So it would be, we would end up with about 33.71. And uh, Guy, what do you want? This is where this is where rubber meets the road. You know what you have. We don't know what he has into this stuff at all. I imagine it's a pretty good bit because there's some uh, expensive pieces here, though. So, I mean, I, I don't expect that we're going to make our normal, our typical margins, but we we do need to make. I, you know, I am. I'm putting it in your y'all's court. You tell me what. Oh my. What you're comfortable with? Well, I mean, we're comfortable with whatever we have to pay. I understand that, but I'm I'm giving I'm. I'm putting it in your court now, both y'all. So well, well, I mean, we we talked. We we no, I mean, we we did talk prior because we were like, I I didn't know how much he had here. I didn't know approximately what the value more was. Than you expected? This is about what I was hoping it would be, okay. because we we discussed yeah, a number so of cool. two thousand dollars, and um, we ex we would expect to make uh, we. We'll probably make about twelve hundred on our end after all said and done, after everything's sold, and that's definitely on the low end of where we like to be. But sometimes to get this kind of stuff, and fast moving stuff, y'all putting yeah. the legwork in it, the time and the labor and all that. And yeah, it it it. And I, this like I'm what? probably looking at I'm probably looking at about three days of work for me. Total man man hours of work, probably three days just for me. So, you know, I'm looking at about making $400 a day clear after everything's sold. That's kind of the way, kind of the terms I look at things in. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's good enough for me if it's good for you. Good? Like I said... We did it. We approached this differently. Mm -hmm. I, I, you know, you're probably wondering why I'm saying, you know, did it this way instead of us just already had the predetermined thing. Oh, I want to make sure that y'all knew what you were getting involved in. Yeah, I'm good. No, we're good with it. This is this is certainly more than we usually pay, but this is isn't also isn't the stuff we normally buy either. No, this is premium. And I understand that you had to probably pay up a pretty good bit too to get the stuff. I don't even know. I have no idea how much guy's making. If we give him two grand, I don't, I don't imagine he's making more than 500 or maybe a little more than that, but I don't think much more. I, I just can't see it. I don't see how the guy would sell it for much less than that. So, yeah, two grand. I just. Y'all are good with it? Yeah. Ah. <sighs> What else? Or you could throw you could throw in a few things if you want. I'm fine with that, but I'm also fine with two grand. Guys looking around trying to throw some stuff in, <laughs> which I'm I won't stop them. But I'm I'm fine. I'm happy to do this at two grand. I was probably a little conservative on some of my comps. I know how Candace comps. No, Candace comps I mean, hard. Well, no. I do, but I, I like if I had like very differential prices, I did an average. I did a lot of times on big buys, I go with a low, but not this time because the stuff is so good. You but know? but you know what I did do? Like if I saw like a five sixty and a four hundred, I went like four sixty or four eighty. That's what I did. I but pushed, yeah. but if there's not another one listed. We'll get the top I'm dollar. Prop, we may or may not get the top dollar, but we're going to try it. Yeah. And if we try it and get it a lot of times, we're going to make more than what we're saying. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, I, but I am I am 100% fine with that number. Yeah. So. For sure. 
Okay, we have everything loaded up, ready to go in the truck. And yes, we did agree on $2,000 for everything. We are gonna be tracking the buy, so we'll, we'll be able to tell y'all how much um, the actual listing price for everything is. Some of this stuff, I couldn't find a price on. Some of the stuff is super obscure. Oh. What? He What's was up? showing me a picture or something. Oh, what you got? Oh, and then Guy is sweetening the pot. <laughs> uh, those of y'all that know, um, those of y'all that know Hot Wheels, y'all might recognize this set. Uh, that's, it's over $2,000 worth of Hot Wheels. Yeah. That golf, that golf set. What year is it from, guy? It's, uh, yeah, if, I think it's 15. 2015? I think so. If you look up, uh, Hot Wheels Golf RLC, yeah. Red Line Club, RLC. then, um, you, you'll be able to see it. We're going to be buying that from Guy real soon. Uh, hopefully. hopefully. Hopefully, as long as the guy will still sell it to him. Yeah. So, we don't know what the price is on that yet for sure. We, we kind of have an idea. But today we're paying guy two grand. Yep. Here you go, guy. Thank, Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wait, here. I'll give you a handshake, too. <laughs> oh, that's man, that's so weird to shake. A handshake. Yeah, huh? yeah, we always. That's, yeah, that's weird. No, that's Girls weird. Shake her hand. For, to shake her hand and not shake my hand. I can't fist bump you. I might gouge you. <laughs> oh, okay. <knuckle> out. <laughs> but thanks a bunch, guy. Appreciate it as usual. And hof hopefully we'll see you again real soon. In the next couple of days, maybe. At least if we can do the deal on the golf set, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And he has Possibly more. Possibly some, uh, some other. And maybe some other stuff. Hopefully. Yeah. Fingers crossed. You never know. You never we, know. You never, guy will usually, you know how I get guy to call me? Is we go out and buy like a truck full of stuff somewhere <laughs> else. That's the best way to get guy to call you. But that's when guy always calls when we're like already inundated. And we're like, oh man. Yeah, here's some more. And we're like, okay. This. No, he called because it's Girl Scout cookie season. Oh yeah, we that's did. Good. We did gift a few uh, Girl Scout Thank cookies. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> and also, good time to thank everyone. Yes. Uh, every one of you guys that bought Girl Scout cookies. We sold. We've had an overwhelming amount of orders. Um, still can take orders through the link, but she has blown her goal away. She's at um over 750 boxes most of which y'all bought yeah. via the yes. via the link most that we from all of you guys so thank you so much we really appreciate it and sh she was just speechless she's speechless yeah. <laughs> yep so uh yeah i think that's going to be it for this one thanks a bunch for watching and we will see y'all again very soon and some people are asking for guys calves and unfortunately it's cold outside. It's a little chilly today. <laughs> maybe, maybe, hopefully next time we make a buy, it'll, it'll be like 78 degrees and Guy will have to bust him out. So, what you got? Take a screenshot of this on your phone okay. so you can research it. I will. That's those, the, that's those the, the golf set. set. Yeah, that's okay. the individual cars. That got it. Okay. Cool. Got it, got that, that's what we might be buying next. Yeah. All right. So, anyway, bye, y'all. Thanks for watching. Sorry, folks. We're, we're still here. Guy... We're just about to, we were making sure we had everything loaded up. And a uh, guy said, wait, wait, come back. I forgot to do a throw in. And uh, he opened up the case. Yep. We got in the case. Uh, I don't want the Tweety Boy Trump versus <laughs> Little Kim Rocket Why Man. Not? That's probably the, uh, the most valuable thing. What is it? What's it worth? I don't know. Look at that thing. It's... Dude, you can stop anytime now. Wait, I was fine with the deal, man. Okay. So we got... Ooh. Last time we got some of these, somebody bought three, not not these, but football the uh, football prisms. Yeah, we had 2021 Panini Prism football draft picks. And guy bought three of the boxes for 15 each. And he let his feedback said that we picked the right ones, or he picked the right ones. Even I picked them up off the shelf. He said he got a case hit, a case hit in one of them. So I don't. I don't know exactly what card that would be in that set. What, what do we have here? 
okay, it's more it's similar ones then. Autographs Blaster box. Like is this the same one? Mm -hmm. what is, what's no, the difference between this and Chronicle. the other one? It's it got different assortments of them. Um, okay. And these are basketballs. Who, yeah, who are the are stars? Twenty twenty one. What's the big What's the big stars in these? Zion almost nineteen, huh? Yeah, he's a flop. Let's see. Okay, cool. Stop, man. All right, we gotta get out. Okay, some he's, sealed Lego. He threw in some sealed Jurassic World Lego. Okay, let's get out of here before guy guys. Go. All right. So anyway, that that is really it. Thanks so much for watching. We will see y'all again very soon. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye. Guy said bye. <laughs> <laughs>